about uh, the Fatima apparition. Okay? So, ang unang-unang Pope is, of course, Pius XII. The, uh, the popularity of this apparition happened during his pontificate, which was also the pontificate of the Second World War. So, it is natural that uh, his concern about Fatima will have uh, a worldwide uh, implication because of the world, war, of the Second World War. The world was at war. So, yung significance ng Fatima, ng Fatima will always be connected with the wars of his, his pontificate. And uh, in his reflection, the Blessed Mother showed her maternal and compassionate heart. Uh, the world was also consecrated to the Immaculate Heart of Mary during this time. Of course, everybody was trying also to do what the what the Blessed Mother asked of Fatima, which is the prayer of her rosary, and for the people to do penance for the conversion of sinners. Apparently, that was done, and uh, the effect was the world war ended. So that is shown by the, heart, the maternal heart of the Blessed Mother towards the whole world. The world war ended. But there was also this, uh, this promise of Fatima that the war will not enter Portugal. So it stopped at its border and Portugal did not suffer uh, the effects of the world war in terms of guns and bullets. It did not enter the, the nation. And uh, that shows the maternal heart of Mary towards uh, Portugal, but also to the whole world, which was, which was uh, the, re the result of the maternal heart of Mary. That is why this is what probably would repeat itself uh, during this period of pandemic and difficulties of the world. Uh, through the prayer of the rosary and our penance for the conversion of sinners and those who are destroying the word of God, this kind of war can also be preserved in the world today. And those who, who, which, who are devoted to her rosary may, as a country may be spared the fruits and effects of this uh, pandemic and the difficulties that the world is suffering. So this is already from the testimony of Pius XII and his consecration of the world to, his, to her Immaculate Heart, a guarantee already. And it was a promise of the Blessed Mother that because of her compassionate heart and maternal heart, she will truly take care of the world and particularly of the country that would be devoted to her devotion and to the praying of the Holy Rosary. So from Pius XII, this should encourage us to go on with what we have started and to get more people to pray the Holy Rosary, not as individuals, but as a group, as the people of God, as the body of Christ, imploring the Immaculate Heart of so good a mother, which appeared in Fatima, and at the same time assuring us to have 
confidence in the mercy of Jesus, in the mercy of the heart of Jesus, and also of her maternal heart. So this is what we can get from the relationship of Fatima and Pope Pius XII. And uh, in the coming days, we'll, let us look also uh, the relationship of this great apparition of Fatima with what the other popes have said after Pius XII. Amen.